Hey guys, it's Glow Reviews 1 on coming at you with my first video. Um, on this channel, I'm going to be posting a bunch of reviews of goalie gear from the skates all the way to the helmet. Um, top to bottom, everything that has to do with goaltending, I'll be trying to bring that over for you. Um, today, if you can see the screen over here, I don't know if it focused on that, I'm going to be reviewing the high quality Paso chest and arm. Paso is a small company out of Quebec that has been in the been in the goalie gear business for a long time. The thing is, the only reason you don't see them at the big stores or in the NHL is because they don't want to pay the pricing that it has to come to get your name branded in the NHL. It costs around $65,000 a year, and on top of that, you have to pay the players for them to wear your equipment. Um, it is one of the better chest and arms on the market for quality, protection, and mobility at the same time. Uh, it com it's in custom sizing from your shoulder to your wrist, from your neckline to your waist. It is completely custom fit to you. One of the downsides is, is it's not one of the chest and arms that you can go on to a store unless you live near them or want to travel to their, um, to their store and try on the equipment. It is mostly based off of uh, a phone call, their website, or you can even Skype video chat them. Uh, I decided to go with the video chat method. I spent a good 45 minutes talking to Hugo, um, getting my sizing and measurements done up. And everything turned out perfect. Well, I can't say perfect because I made one mistake, which I'll explain later in the video. Um, as I was saying, all the, all the, it's all custom to you. You can go on their website, you can order the stock uh, chest protector with your custom measurements. Um, you can get like a, extra small arms on a double extra large body if you even wanted that. But if you do the Skype call, you can talk to Hugo, you can get custom colors, your logo on your back, your name. Um, uh, personally, I would just rather choose the Skype call. Sorry about that. Um, uh, I got the chest protector a couple weeks ago when my summer camp just started up. So I only got to use it twice, and then comes to the mistake. I'll bring it with just Everything is perfect. Everything turned out exactly how I wanted it. But my measurement that I did from my neckline to the bottom, I did completely wrong. So I made them too short for what I actually wanted. So I was talking to Hugo, he sent that, all I had to do was pay shipping, he sent down an extra extension to add on here, so it probably takes it down another couple inches, so that I can untuck my chest protector and wear it comfortably the way that I want to. As you can see, this is a very sharp looking chest protector. And this only limits, this is like limiting the options that they could do. They could do pretty much anything you want, you could probably get different color uh, floaters and everything. My team colors are exactly as you were seeing. It is a red base. Well, my away jersey is a red base with white sport gold and a little bit of black, but I didn't want to waste time putting on black because it doesn't even look very good. Um, one thing I think I shouldn't have done, or if I thought it through, I shouldn't have got white elbows. Elbow and forearm, I guess. Because with my camp jersey, the jerseys are super tight, so I have to uh, keep this part like exposed so I can move my arm right. and. It's a mesh, so it will get marked up very fast, but that has nothing to do with the company that was on my choice. Um, it is a very light chest protector. After putting it on, I came from the 2010 model of the Bauer Pro, which is also a very light chest protector. I even think this was lighter. Um, out of the box, I put it on, put it on, and it felt very light, very mobile, which was very surprising. And even with the mobility, you could feel their stiffness. The arms are a bit different than most chest protectors, and like, it's hard to explain. They're s mobile as anything, but they're very stiff. So you can move your arm in any direction you want, no problem, but it's like very stiff padding, so you won't feel a shot. Um, on this chest protector, I got the extra protection, or beefed it up. And what they did, they, def they definitely beefed up the arms, they beefed up everything through here, and they put a, a removable, 
a removable thing that I can slide out. All I'd have to do was undo these straps in the back. I don't know if you can see from there. Undo the two straps here and just slide it off because it's like hooked. It's hooked on with one of these. And talking about straps, the adjustability on the chest protector is absolutely amazing. Coming from the Bauer Pro, I didn't really know what fit me right until I got this. This fits like a glove. Um, I know that's an expression used a lot. Some people don't want that. I personally don't like it fitting super tight, but uh, that all comes down to the adjustability. Um, there's options that you can get. I chose the Velcro. Oh, and also this is the extra rib protection here. So yeah, you can take that off. This is a Velcro system. You Velcro it and put the extra rib protection over it. Personally, I think it's better to get the extra rib protection for uh, one, it protects you more than what it, than what you even need. And for two, it will keep all this Velcro in good shape because um, it Velcro's onto the strap, and then it just covers everything that could also be durable. Yeah, that could help the durability. I don't know if you guys can see from there, but I got my custom logo. I got my team logo, and my name on it, and. Which they can do for you, no problem. Um, and yeah, one of the mistakes that I made again with the extent with the extension. Come up closer here. Um, as I got a medium, medium arms, medium body, but then I got since I don't tuck my chest protector, I got them to lace in. An extension so it makes it more flexible, way more flexible, so that when I when I go down on my butterfly when I'm with, with my uh, chest protector not tucking it will not get caught up and that will work perfectly it's just I did the sizing wrong so and that'll be here within a day or two and I'll do an update for you guys. Overall, I'm very pleased with how this chest protector turned out. And if you guys have any other questions or anything like that, just uh, comment, stuff like that. Message me, just message me any questions you need and I'll answer them. I'll leave the website in the description and yeah. Comment, rate, subscribe. See you later guys.